essentially the simple the simple thread that that flows through the play is that of the story of uh, two lovers who are essentially Romeo and Juliet, um, but in a more serious, much darker way. Fate takes them on their journey, and we are exposed to all kinds of interesting things along the journey. Um, questions that are have to do with morality, questions that have to do with um, power. And as the play progresses, the more and more questions of morality get thrown up. And you have to make a decision between, in the end of the play, you're left with a decision as to who is morally correct and who is morally corrupt. And it's surprising, I think, the decisions that right-minded people tend to drift towards because they seem to be wrong. But nevertheless, they are there. And so the play challenges you, makes you think. Um, what, what really appeals to me in these plays is the emotional, um, the, the, they are so emotionally charged. Uh, and I love dealing with that. I love detailing that. And in this play particularly, um, it's, it's a, in, in some respects, it's unlike some of the other uh, revenge tragedies because it has a very, uh, along with the real, heavy drama, there is also a very, very comedic story that is one of the um, subplots that's interwoven along with four other subplots throughout the play. It's very complicated stuff, uh, which is, for me, that's, that's the challenge of it. You know, it's, it's un, undoing all the bits and then putting them all back together again in a comprehensible way for a contemporary audience. There are some really excellent performances in the show. Um, it's challenging stuff and they've bitten into it and made a, made a meal of it. Um, I think it, it, it has everything in it. It's got high drama, it's got, it's got really, really excellent comedy. It's got, um, it's got murder. It's, it's, like, it's sort of like uh, classical theater presented as an action film. And I think that uh, so you have that you have that solid classical element. You've got the ver verse drama, um, along with the with really in this play peculiarly a, a lot of quite contemporarily contemporarily dynamic action. Um, he's a, he's an unusual writer, John Ford, who wrote the play. In that, I think he writes in a very contemporary fashion. It's very fast paced. Um, doesn't really give you too much of anything and always leaves you with bits that you have to pick up and carry and run with in order to, 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 to keep up with the pace of the play.